Well. Certainly looks like Mercer and Carlyle have already been here. Or potentially Mercer, depending. <laughs> Something tells me these poor swords never had a chance. Excuse me, Nocturnal. Right, I'll be more polite. If you'll stop breaking my lockpicks. This is a great way to start any sort of venture in it. You know, maybe if I shut up and focus, I'll actually know what I'm doing, eh? Note to self. Oh, God, look at that thing. <laughs> oh, that could be Andy. I might actually put that on. I don't know how to use it, but... Oh, right. <laughs> Every time I dig around in my bag and I find... Uh, all of this. And I just kind of... Alright, so that's... How do you... I'm seriously magic inept is what I'm learning from all of these artifacts. Right, the key to me actually being a successful thief is shutting my mouth for once. So. Unfortunately for me, I've never once in my life been the quiet type. Oh, ah. ow. Right. Ah, oh, poor girl. <laughs> Looking for love. Found a dagger. I don't trust those things. No, I do not. Mm. Hello. Oh. Now that's what I call percussive maintenance. AKA whack it with a hammer till it breaks. More carnage. And yet. Yep. What do you think this sells for? Never know when you might need a bit of dwarven oil. For what? I don't know, shaving? Ah, oh, there's another one. And another one. Uh, two. Alright. Oh, jeez. Alright. Get out of the corner. These little wheelie bastards have actually some valuable stuff on them. Lovely. Ugh, foggy. Really? 
Uh, right. Now, where am I supposed to be? Look at that little bugger. Supposed to be going. Oh, hi. No, sorry, I'm not dealing with you little buggers today. You'd think there's a way up here, right? Oh, amazed I can reach that. Hang on. Benefits of being tall, I suppose. Nice. Now, can I get in there? Eh, probably not. Well, shit. Alright. So there's another way that I've just... Oh. Alright. And we just go. Hello, little spidery boys. Alright, now I'll fight you. Come on, who's next? Oh. Alright, alright, come on. I see two of you are still steaming. You're a smart little bugger. There we go. Run them in here. Eh, leave them. Dolphin tumblers. Now I'm sure that Carly and Brynjolf were sitting around somewhere going, Wow, we can hear this orc lady coming from a mile away. And yeah, a little bit. Oh crap. Yeah, alright. Uh, right, I'm just gonna let him do his thing. However... Yeah, as you do. Ah, there you are. Oh, hey. And Brynn is still in his nightingale uniform. Mercer's has been here. I hope we aren't too late. I wondered about that. The... I saw the bandits. Brynjolf and I found them like that. Mercer's doing. We have to catch up to him before it's too late. Alright, well, let's be on our way then. We should tread carefully. I wouldn't be surprised if he's left behind a few surprises for us. <laughs> Careful. Carlo, I don't know if we've met. I'm not exactly the definition of careful.
And if that's the worst that he has in store for us, I think we can handle it. Let's go. All hands on deck. Now look. Wait a moment. What's that? A bunch of farmers. It's Mercer. Look. Down there. I'm on it, lass. Ah. There it is. Scheme bastard. Damn it. There's no way through. Uh, of course not. He's toying with us. He wants us to follow. Aye, lass. And we'll be ready for him. Let's keep moving. Oh boy. Alright, let's go. Catch up with that bastard before it gets too far ahead, eh? Hopefully. Now, of course. Look at the size of this place. Have you ever seen anything like it in your life, lass? Can't say that I have. Imagine the riches hidden within these walls. I imagine there aren't any, there aren't many, anyway, left. If the, uh, Dwemer dug them all out. Right, now what's this? Fantastic. The other one's over there. Alright. That makes this easy. Oh, hello. I'll give no quarter. <laughs> That's why I'm the best. Bring you darkness. That's why we're the best, Brio. Oh, son of a... So, fun fact... Those turn off after a time. I don't know how much time. But this is going to be interesting. Still going. All right. You fell my swords. What are those? I'm not sure I want to know. So I'm just going to do this. Hello. I heard something. Yeah, so did I. Finally, let's end this. That's what happens when you cross the guild. Did you just? All right. Ah. No pushing, Kalaya. Be careful. Oh, nice. There's no telling what lurks within these walls. My guess is Falma and Falma adjacent things, creatures. There we are. Okay. Now we've got to be quick. But that's fine. Excuse me. Uh, 
There we go. Alright. And out we go. Fantastic. I'll just make sure the other two didn't get stuck. There's Bryn. There's Kalai. Nice. Alright. Oh. Careful. Oh. And look at this place. This looks kind of dangerous. Looks like we can take the low road or the high road across this chamber. Your choice. Did you really bring your You take the high road and I'll take the low road and I'll be in Skyrim before you. Or whoever that goes. And I think. I don't like the idea of taking a low road when I might lead to an ambush. Just saying. Let's do. this. Hello. Who's there? Whoa. Guide my hand. I promised that wasn't me. Oh, gods. Careful, Bryn. Darkness consume you! You are no match for a nightingale. Did, did, wait, what was that? You know, who knows? I know we've got more somewhere. I like the echo in this place. I'm not sure I want to try singing again, lest something else collapse. I oh, promise hello. a swift but painful end. I promise the same if I can actually hit the dead thing. Uh, you've got this under control. I am stuck. Alright. Uh, okay. Oh, looks like more low road, high road business. I'm never going to be able to forget that now, Bryn. Thanks. Oh, a lady. That was a good chest. Also, I'm going to take this silver because silver is valuable. What I wouldn't give right now for a crossbow. Hey, come on, yeah? With any luck, this will be Mercer's final day alive. Not the way you think. I was going to suggest you shoot that thing from here. However... Alright, uh, we've got to deal with this. By Nocturnal's grace, I will defeat you! Ow! Dodge this! My aim is... I think they got the message. I think they did too. I live another day. Oh. I just assumed die before I'd let Mercer get those gems. Alright. This must be what we heard. I think. Seems pretty recent. Alright, well. He slowed us down. And we're still going. Did he just... I Bryn? Oh, good goats. Alright, be careful. Not step on the bear traps. Malachite. A shovel. In case you need shoveling for some reason. Alright, that's the way we're supposed to be going.
one step ahead. Mercer. Oh, that slimy bastard. Now here's my question. Did he come through here first, and then go out the other way and then collapse the tunnel? It's the only thing that makes sense to me. <laughs> it's a mark dusty. Oh shit. You know... If that thing comes alive... I'm just gonna say it's a good thing I've got a hammer. <laughs> so it looks like it's full of a couple of nails. Oh, look at this place. Very, very dangerous. You know what? Who's I'll that? No quarter. There we are. Let's see if this does some of the work on the... On the farmer. <laughs> Dodge this! Yeah. Oh boy. Woohoo! Come on, you big dwemery bested. <laughs> oh shit. Oh, they killed it! Okay, that's not what I was expecting to happen. You just made the last mistake of your life. I might have. <laughs> Your death will be swift. You got this. You don't got this. I got this. Well, I had a good idea. The execution might have needed work. And they got fish down here. Very nice. Damn. You know, I, I expected that to go a lot differently. Nice. Well, oh, hang on, what was that? Some collector is going to pay a lot for that. I'm almost sure of it. Waiting for more of them to come crawling out. Ah, uh, right. How do we get out? How do we get up there? Ah, uh ah. -huh. Probably going all the way around there. Aye. Because of course, that makes sense. Skeevers. Ah. Well, that was a near miss, wasn't it? Goads! Okay, well... Thank you, Nocturnal! I forgive you for the lockpicks! Because that was a close one. Whew! Right. This looks like it's going to be fun. Where are these bastards getting all their bear traps? More silver, I like that. Alternatively, Mercer put these here because he's always one step ahead. That's fine. What was that? That's what happens when you cross the gill. It is. I live another day. Oh, yours. Your fate is I think they, they got dark, the message. Darkness. You know when people say I'll crush you like a bug? I think I just did that. How was it good for that sort of thing? It's not the stealthiest weapon, but I've never been the stealthiest person. Right. 
You can be one step ahead all you want. But there are two things that come to all of us eventually. Death and taxes. And he owes us a pretty big do. This is where we saw Mercer. We must be getting close. Indeed. Yeah, one step ahead, Mercer, but for how long? Eh? The stench. This place reeks of Falmer. This must be their hive. We'll have to keep silent if we want to avoid drawing their attention. You know, that's a pretty big if, Kalaya. I say we just smoke all of them. Yeah, just as I was getting warmed up. <laughs> that's pretty, uh. shocking. <laughs> Look, if you can't find humor in a situation like this, what even is the point, right? Hello. I will take that. Bryn? Who's there? There's a... I hardly felt a thing. Uh, yeah, clearly. You'd have turned around if you had. What was that? Oh. I could use some practice. You are no match for Just as I was getting warmed up. Speaking of which... <laughs> right, keep moving. Anyone down here? Nope. Oh, shh. Even the farmer don't ah. deserve the pain these implements must have inflicted. The dwarves were a cruel race. Hmm. I take that. Another one of those things. I'm conveniently ignoring the fact that there's a hot poker in the fire and blood all over this table. Definitely ignoring that. This looks like traps. Oh, goes all right. We'll go around. Step lightly. Ah! Oh. What the crap did I just say? That's fine. There's a mass of the farmer in this chamber. We can sneak through or take them down. I don't care. Wait, I hear something. I could use some <laughs> I think they go. What was that? You're a much better. There you are. Oh, God. Oh, sorry, Bryn. Kind of caught you there, didn't I? Hello. The afterlife will bring you darkness. I think they're kind of used to that. So one would sort of hope so. Also, sorry about that, Bryn. I got distracted saying you're much better with daggers than Mercer is. And I uh, forgot that there were a bunch of Falmer creeping up on us, so that was my bad. Ugh. We've got to go through there. It. Yeah. Well, that's disgusting. I can hear water. 
water rushing through these pipes. We must be beneath a lake. Yeah, I wonder. That gives me all sorts of ideas, and all of them are destructive and probably bad. What was that? What you think? Hello. What? Jeez. Bit slidey. Give up. And that's why I'm the best. I don't think they give up. I live another day. Farmer don't really know what give up means, I don't think. How did they manage this? You'd think that lock construction is a little bit beyond their skill level, but here we are. All right. Oh, this is interesting. Careful. What was enough games? Let's consume you. Big ugly bug. Disgusting. And of course I don't have anything Yeah, I don't have anything about poison besides poisons. Which some tells me these buggers are immune to. So Kalaya, do me a favor. Don't do that. Not much scares me, but that did. That surprised me anyway. Oh, says a difference, if a subtle one. Hello. Who's there? I bring death from the shadows. I Mercy, think they got the message. Shadows. I live yeah. another day. You know, bringing death from the shadows sort of works better if you don't announce it beforehand. Just charge out of nowhere and smack them. That's what I do. Sometimes. <laughs> Sometimes it works. Oh. Nope. No, do with that. He's close. I'm certain of it. We must prepare ourselves. Then this is it. We do this for Gallus and for the guild. Right. Let's see what this bastard has up his sleeves, eh? He's here, and he hasn't seen us yet. Brynjolf, watch the door. Aye, lass. Nothing's getting by me. Climb down that ledge. See if you can... Carlia, when will you learn you can't get the drop on me? Well. When Brynjolf brought you before me, I could feel a sudden shift in the wind. And at that moment, I knew it would end with one of us at the end of a blade. Well, Mercer, that's where you're wrong. I have a hammer. Now, give me the key. What's Carlyle been filling your head with? Tales of thieves with honor? Oaths ripe with falsehoods and broken promises? Nocturnal doesn't care about you, the key, or anything having to do with the guild. You know, Mercer... It's not about Nocturnal. At this point, it's personal. Revenge, is it? Have you learned nothing from your time with us? When will you open your eyes and realize how little my actions differ from yours? Both of us lie, cheat, and steal to further our own end. 
Alright. The difference is I never considered myself one of you. Not really. Not until now. And I happen to have my honor. It's clear you'll never see the skeleton key as I do, as an instrument of limitless wealth. Instead, you've chosen to fall over your own foolish code. Aye. Well, you know what? If I'm gonna fall, I'm gonna take you with me. How about that? Then the die is cast, and once again my blade will taste Nightingale blood. Carlia, I'll deal with you after I rid myself it's of your pain irksome companions. In the meantime, perhaps you and Brynjolf should get better acquainted. What? What's happening? I can't stop myself. Damn you, Mercer. Fight it, Brynjolf. He's taken control of you. I'm sorry, lass. I... I can't. You can't hide from me. The king and his men stole the queen from her bed. And bound her in her bones. The seas be ours, and by the powers where we will, will roam. Yo ho, all together, hoist the colors high. Heave ho, thieves and beggars, never shall we die. Damn, this place is coming down. Quick, get the skeleton key and the eye and let's get out of here. No luck there, lass. Something must have fallen on the other side of the door because it isn't moving. We have to find another way out of here before the place... Oh, wow. with water you know in my case that's an opposite of that's the opposite of a problem because i can swim i hope you two can too otherwise this is going to get real ugly real fast yo ho all hands Hoist the colors high. He ho, thieves and beggars, never shall we die. Hey, that looks like a nice way out. What? All that. <sighs> It'll hire. Awkward ascent into a tunnel I've ever had. Who's there? Fire! Let's end this! Stop this! Finally! Let's end this! Bless you, Lady of Shadows. I live another day. See, that is an appropriate reaction to what just happened. I can't believe it's over. Twenty-five years in exile and just like that, it's done. All that remains is to ensure the safe return of the skeleton key. Well, sounds like that would be a simple task, aye? Who am I returning it to? I'm afraid it's not that simple. 
When the skeleton key was stolen from the Twilight Sepulchre, our access to the Inner Sanctum was removed. The only way to bring it back will be through the Pilgrim's Path. Oh, I take it you never used the Pilgrim's Path. It wasn't created for the Nightingales. It was created to test those who wish to serve Nocturnal in other ways. As a consequence, I have no knowledge of what you'll be facing. Oh, lovely. Well, and we'd best get started, eh? Brynjolf is needed back at the Thieves' Guild to keep order while you're away. And I... I can't bear to face Nocturnal after my failure to protect the key. I'm afraid you'll have to face the end of your journey alone. Uh, don't worry about it. I am sort of a... a lone agent in all of this, aren't I? Not quite a nighty girl, not quite a thief. Thus the honour. Take this with you. I'm not certain if it will help within the walls of the Sepulchre, but I certainly don't need it as much as you. I've had this bow almost my entire life, and it's never let me down. I hope it brings you the same luck. Come on, I don't do... Kalaya? My aim is shit. <laughs> it's why I have a hammer. Alright. So what's the story with the Pilgrim's Path? Even though Nocturnal doesn't desire worship in the traditional sense, the Twilight Sepulchre propagated a small group of priests. Of course, they never come into direct contact with Nocturnal. But they insisted they had her favor. As part of their duties, the priests created all sorts of baseless rituals and ceremonies, all on Nocturnal's behalf. As you do. And it didn't interfere with the Nightingales? These priests weren't a threat to the Skeleton Key, or the conduit to Nocturnal's realm, so they were tolerated. One of their ceremonies involved the Pilgrim's Path, a so-called test of worthiness. If a Pilgrim was able to complete the path, it was said that they would live forever in twilight. What that means is anyone's guess. <laughs> Blessed with stealth? I don't know. Right, good to know. That's about all I have. Whoa. Sorry, yes, lass. I've got important things to do. We'll speak another time. Right. Sorry, lass. I've got important things to do. We'll speak another time. I'll let you two get on with it then. <sighs> it's nice. People say revenge is a dish best served cold. It's a good thing my hammer is made out of storium. <laughs>